it's Elise. Okay, so today I'm going to be doing a prank video, and I'm gonna be like, I'm gonna meet you up because I feel like. But I'm gonna be doing a prank video, and I'm gonna be pranking my best friend Ellie, and I'm gonna be pranking my sister and my parents. So these are kind of pranks that you can do like with your family and your friends. So April Fools is tomorrow, and I'm so excited because I have some good ones to show you. So yeah, so I will be. Showing you guys all these things, and I hate when people have long intros, so let's, let's get into the video. Let's get started. Okay, so for this soap prank, you're gonna need any kind of soap, and I just use clear nail polish that I didn't really use. And then you're just gonna paint your entire soap with clear nail polish so that it's completely covered. For this next prank, you're going to need some black tape, scissors, and a remote. The first thing that you're gonna do is take the tape and measure out how long you need it to be to cover the remote. So you wanna get it to the part where it connects to the TV. Then stick the tape onto the remote where it connects to the TV and try to lay it on there as flat as you can so it's not noticeable. You can also use this for many other types of remotes. Okay, so for this toothbrush prank, all you're gonna need is a toothbrush, some blue food coloring. Really, the drops are the best, but I didn't have that. So I just used like this icing food coloring. And I just kind of put like some of it on my toothbrush. And then I didn't have a video of this, but I kind of like mixed it in to the toothbrush. And then I added toothpaste on top to kind of cover it off. Alright, so for this grapefruit juice, I used the artificial cheese from the macaroni and cheese boxes, and then I added it to a cup of water, and then I mixed it all together. And like in the end, it kind of turned it out a lot more orange than I thought, so I added some red food coloring to make it like a grapefruity color. And then when I mixed it together, it kind of came to like what I wanted it to be. And then, yeah. Okay, so for this key prank, all you need is a key that your parents or your friends use a lot, and a cup, and also a cutting board. So just fill your cup all the way to the top of, with water, and then you just drop the key inside and put the cutting board on top and hold it really firmly. And then if you grab the cup underneath and then you flip it really fast, But then this is like the tricky part. You have to like slide it off really carefully, except if you do it fast, it works better. Oh, Elise, let's go. Can you grab the keys? They're on the counter. Yeah. Okay, so Ellie.
For this door prank, you're only going to need saran wrap. So what I did was I just took a really long piece of saran wrap and I kind of just like put it onto the doorway and then I taped it on the sides to hold it in place. As much as you can, you want to make it so that it, you can't see it at all, so that it's really tight and clear. And if your siblings do this, you're screwed.